So, a little bit of, and it's great that they've got like the uh, Crisis Lifeline and all of that kind of stuff right there up on the screen. Well done, Konami. Very good. Basically, uh, the themes of this, like a lot of the Silent Hill games, might be a little bit touchy for some. I am just letting you guys know, if you do not know anything about Silent Hill, kind of dives deep into uh, these sorts of themes. So if this is something that does rub you the wrong way, please exit the stream as of right now. Uh, Silent Hill tackles these kinds of themes, abuse, all that sort of shit. And I know for some people that can be incredibly touching. I think most of you guys will probably be aware as to like what Silent Hill is, uh, but just basically for the people that don't, yeah, just as a little disclaimer, keep yourself safe know that like this is this kind of gets a little bit deep from time to time oh right as i ended the stream you sent a dono tardis oh yes i see it right here the game awards didn't uh kojima announce a horror game with jordan pele um okay yeah so that is od which is from what i understand an xbox exclusive uh that is totally separate to that of death stranding it's like some unique new way of playing a game um, that had been, like, rumored for a long-ass time, whether or not it's, like, AR or something, I don't know. It sounds pretty out of it, to be fair, but I think it's an Xbox exclusive. That doesn't have anything to do with both Death Stranding as well as the thing he was teasing uh, in the state of play. So, I guess currently right now he's working on three different projects, which is sort of insanity in itself. I guess that man knows how to work. <laughs> Wait, was this a demo? So it's kind of a demo, but like it's its own thing, if you know what I mean. I think it's just a small experience to sort of um, tech demo what the next generation of Silent Hill is going to look like. The reason why I'm interested is it reminds me heavily of like the current Resident Evils, like 7 and 8. Uh, but more so, of course, um, the cancelled PT, which was Silent Hills that uh, Kojima was actually working on. So it's kind of like, in a way, I guess you could say like this, as well as all of the new Silent Hills that are going to be developed by uh, Konami, are the spiritual successes to that of PT, which is a game that has been lost to time. All right, also, uh, as it always goes, guys, just let me know if I need to adjust any, like, audio levels or anything like that. If the game needs to be increased volume-wise, then do let me know. Let's have a look at some options. We've got the master volume, the sound effects, the dialogue volume, very good controls. From what I could tell, like, in the trailer, it looks pretty much just like a walking sim. That's sort of what I expect from these kinds of games. Hey, what's going on, Grey Fox? Good to see me back. Hey, good to see you Seeking back, dude. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. True. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who That's a way of looking at it. To fit into a group are pathetic. That's true. That's true. There's no beauty in living like that. Always be true to yourself. I want to be strong on my own. Without a group. Friends are important though. Like my friends are my power. There's only someone who would understand that. She needs to sit down and have a talk me. with Sora. <laughs> Does this mean I'm in luck for playing the Mickey Mouse horror game on stream? Yeah, we can look at doing that. When it comes out, why not? <laughs> this girl is giving me like Mia Khalifa slash sort of, uh, was it Frey, Freya, Frey vibes from Forspoken? Like a crossover type amalgamation? Amalgamation is probably the wrong word. <laughs> James! What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? I should probably have both headphones on if I want to shit myself. Nah, this game's not even going to be that scary. It's pretty hard to spook me, just saying. Although I'm pretty prone for frights, but that's like if someone comes up and like, you know, 
shakes me from out of nowhere. More so like jump scare kind of shit. Pfft, doesn't bother me at all. Alright, Maya, I want to show you something. Can you come to the villa? Oh, yeah. Maya told me to come here. Okay, I... <laughs> Why? It's like some decrepit, abandoned building. What the fuck? Why are you guys hanging out here, man? Like, it's a bit weird. Okay. I'm loving the atmosphere. I, I love s spooky shit. And, like, the new direction that Silent Hill was going to take with PT looked awesome. As I was saying, Resident Evil 7 and 8. Especially the vibe of Resident Evil 7 over 8. So good. This model. Is it this building? I don't know, you're asking the wrong guy. I only just got here, too. I have no idea, man. The plan to rebuild Kettenstad, an overview. Kettenstad, a town with a long history as a thriving border stronghold. In recent years, those in their 20s have begun leaving en masse, causing concern. The aim of this wide-scale project is to rebuild Kettenstad and restore it to its former glory with the help of Chinese investment firms. Ah! Ah, that, that's sussy. That's sussy. The theme is revitalization. The abandoned properties developed by Japanese corporations in 2008 have long been a problem, but by repurposing them, we can cut costs substantially and better realize our vision for new kittens, Dad. Wow. So this place didn't always suck. Our parents dreamed of this? That's a cute teddy bear. That's a cute teddy bear. Wait, so friends aren't my... Well, see, yeah, I mean, that that's kind of like what she was saying, right, at the beginning. Like, I don't need friends, I don't need nobody. Maybe she's being betrayed or something, you know, or she's dealt with a lot of bullying or something. That sucks in that case, All right? That does. COVID is mentioned here? Plans to rebuild Kid instead have suffered yet another major setback as instability caused by COVID-19. COVID-19 in my video game? COVID-19 in my fucking video game, dude? Previous plans to jumpstart the town failed to materialize, owing to the monetary instability caused by the 2008 global financial crisis, which forced the plan uh, to involve Japanese corporations and finance to... Financial, blah, 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 English words, institutions to be reconsidered. Two attempts to rebuild, two failures due to unfortunate external circumstances. Kentonstad has struggled to bounce back with increased unemployment. Sounds like the city's just going completely fucking downhill. Uh, the city council is considering ways to revitalize the economy by drawing skilled experts to the area, but as of yet, no effective measures have been implemented. Everyone's losing their futures. Hey, she's not wrong. We are. We're absolute fucking fools. Oh man, I'm loving this atmosphere. I'm still like uber confused as to why Maya wanted to come here. Like, what's the angle you're playing at, Maya? Oh, yo, that's not unsettling. No exit, alright. Anything in the fridge? We got some like 20 year old mayonnaise. Herbs. We got herbs. On shit developers. Wait, oh shit developers? <laughs> I suppose Konami are trying to make it relatable in regards to COVID. Uh, to all Villa residents, we have received many inquiries about the management of this building after the recent news. We would therefore like to hold a meeting to explain our policies more formally. We hope you can find time to attend the meeting. Uh, apartment meetings. You know, if I was living in an apartment, I would not be attending. I got no time for fucking communal meetings, man. Telling me that the, uh, the fucking sewage system and the building's all up to shit. I'll continue to shit. I don't give a damn. That ain't my problem. Maya? Loving all of these tags, like the just the raw atmosphere um, of this is incredible. I know this is kind of like the way the the sort of trend way to approach horror games now, but like I love it. I I think it's fantastic. Visually, this game is gorgeous. 
lots of tanking going on. For a graffiti artist, spray paint and a blank wall are all you need in Kittenstad, okay? So they got a bit of a uh, tag culture going on. The walls of a particular apartment building are the canvas for several artists, with a new piece showing up every day. Social media star CB features her work here, given her passion for flowers. Flowers in the, in the freezer, okay? It's only fitting that her name is CB, uh, which is short for Cherry Blossom. CB's art continues to captivate the hearts of the young, so we've reached out to her for a comment. So this is basically like Banksy. This is Silent Hill's version of Banksy. Keeping her eyes fixed on her new piece, she had this to say. All I'm doing is showing what these girls feel on the inside but can't show on the outside. If any of them connect with a girl in the art, it's probably because they're experiencing the same thing. CB added that the flowers she depicts on the young girls she paints blooms out of scars they bear. The flowers represent the girls overcoming past traumas, or at least their desire to do so. Everyone can see how talented she is. I couldn't be more different. Oh, okay, that's a gorgeous message. I love that. Did Maya do this? CB. Okay, so Maya is CB. That's Maya's signature. She's... Amazing. Our character sounds completely the fucking drained. <laughs> begging for us to paint it with our hopes and dreams. I want to show the hidden side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. Hey, I'd like a little bit of in... in I was... Whoo! I was about to say the graphics. What are you hiding inside? The fucking graphics! But no, that's a real person. That's a real person. Don't worry about what people think. Do I like Life is Strange? I actually have never played Life is Strange. I feel like I probably should though, because I've heard great things. I have heard uh, great things. How could I ever be proud of myself? I will admit, um, I always find it a little bit cringe. And like a little bit um I don't know uh, what's the word for it what's the word for it staggering or something like that when um a game incorporates live action footage sort of like Need for Speed 2 back in the day used to do that Need for Speed Underground 2 is that a baby hold on I gotta bump this volume up I gotta take it all the way man Silent Hill, I want you to tickle my eardrums. Okay, it's at the highest it can possibly go. The highest it can possibly go. Uh, just before we proceed, guys, is the audio all good for you dudes? Like, do, do you want to shit or, like, not shit? I can tone it down. I can turn it up. Final Fantasy VII soon. Can't wait, dude. I. It's going to be a masterpiece. It'll be, like, FF7's version of Kingdom Hearts 2. It's fine. Cool. That sucks, man. Like, you need a head. You can see my character is shaking. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> that swag. It's good to know that swag is uh, still a relevant name. Oh, that's gorgeous. Let me give you all. Camera just auto turned. Emily? Emily, you all right? You asleep? You still asleep? Sorry if I woke you up. Didn't see you at your job yesterday. Still not feeling good. You taking your meds? Sorry for the late reply. I fell asleep. Jesus, desperate much. Desperate much. Don't worry about it. How you feeling? I'm okay. I can actually kind of get some rest now. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. How dare you take like several hours to reply to me? Do you know what's strange? Like... Emily is a real person, what looks like a real person, and then our character is a, a computer-generated person. You see what I mean? It's it's a little bit, like, staggering seeing that. <laughs> I'm still a little tired, but I'm gonna get up soon. Okay. That's a relief. How are you just, like, all good about wandering around in a fucking weird apartment building like this? This is not normal. 
think she's stuck in her own head. This is Silent Hill after all. Go rumbler! Stick him up! Damn, this creep, creep, pervert, insane, stupid, insane, creep, you moron, hate, stupid, loser, liar. I don't think someone's the biggest fan of us. I, I don't think this person likes us. Child abuse slash neglect in Kittenstead. A recent statistical survey has shown the rate of child abuse in Kittenstad last year was nearly double that of the average in other developed nations in Europe. The recent econ uh, economic strife and its resulting poverty are thought to be the cause. Yeah, that is an unfortunate thing. Money causes people to do terrible things, man. She's gross. Oh my god. Okay, this is terrible. <laughs> Right, what you got hiding in here? Any any bread? I need some bread. It's gotta be whole grain though. I don't fuck with any rye or any white. It's gotta be whole grain. I need my my grains. Not my grains. I need grains. I need my space grains. Antidepressants. I've taken enough medication. Medicopsis. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely like some kind of inner thought stuff going on here. The atmosphere of this light is insane, man. Ah, oh, lovely. Oh, yum. Food. Food. Bro, that's a PlayStation 5 cockroach, man. Look at that. Holy shit, the detail on that roach! You guys seen this? Sensitive topic step? Yeah, Silent Hill does tackle these. Um, again, before we continue, I feel like I need to make another disclaimer. If you aren't familiar with Silent Hill, it tackles some intense topics, some deep shit. Uh, so if you are easily triggered by this kind of thing, please do not watch any more of this stream. Uh, it can be a little bit unsettling for some people. So just letting you guys know, uh, this is the sort of themes that uh, Silent Hill takes on. Horror games always have, like, the, the worst-looking toilets. Why is this, like, a thing? I suppose it adds to the atmosphere, but, like, they're the most filthiest, unclean, dirtiest, shit-ridden, like, bowls you're gonna find in any form of media is in horror games. That's a pool of... Well, a bath of blood. Love that. Oh no. Don't do it. Don't suck it. No. I'm no. I'm sorry. Yeah, damn, this game's not uh not playing around. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. This game is not playing around. Mom. Why does this remind me of PT? Yeah, uh basically PT was gonna be Silent Hill. Um, so in a weird way, it kind of is PT in that sense. Unfortunately, though, Kojima is not working with this at all. He's kind of doing his own thing now. Um, yeah, unfortunate about that. This is, I guess, the next best thing. <laughs> oh my god, Emily, what? What about you, Anita? What? Yeah, what? What? You didn't look so hot the other day. I'm fine. It's good to know she cares. You don't have to worry about me. Hey, let him in! We have to let them in! Well, obviously, I'm gonna... I'm taking my meds. Meds are good. But what about therapy? That doesn't really uh, do much, to be honest. I'm talking to adults... Oh, wait, no. Talking to adults doesn't help. Some of our classmates were hospitalized. You don't have to do this alone. I know. I'll let you know if I need anything. 
And those guys deserved it. Oh, shit. Okay. Beef? And they feel bad, you know? All of them. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Pro tip here. If you are ever feeling down, I've been in uh, a few states myself over the uh, course of time. Talking makes all the difference. So long as you do have someone that you feel comfortable enough to uh, open up to. Uh, towards that manner of things. Look, I'm not trying to be life coach 306, right? But, um, just saying. Pro life tip, talking always helps. Maya? It's not good to bottle shit up. Ah! 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 Wait, what? Oh, fuck, it is actually behind me! I thought we were safe, the door closed! What are you, fucking teleport? Wait, did I not open the door? What happened? Whoa, what? I don't know. I, I, I'm asking you. I, did we just go back in time? Do we have powers? What happened? <laughs> what? Okay. Alright, let's try that again. I was fart assing around. This time, no fart assing. Just, just run. 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 Open. Don't look behind. Why would you look behind? Ah! 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 This way. This uh, open the fucking door. I didn't look behind. Run, run. Am I safe? Where did it even go? What the fuck was that thing? I'm taking it. That's your friend. We should not be here. It, it's time to either wake up or get the fuck out. I'm in the studio. No, you're not. You were in the hall. That was you. That you, You're you playing me now. This is a prank. There's a monster here. I mean, she was kind of sexy, though, at the same time. You guys see those legs? Whew. I mean, damn. I mean, you know, hey, you know, whatever works. Uh, teenage suicides continue at infamous building. A rundown apartment complex in Kedinstad has become known for its suicides, uh, with teenage girls jumping from its roof practically every... Yeah, this, this town seems terrible. Like, terrible. That being said, it is, unfortunately, the reality around the world. Uh, despite repeat events, the building, abandoned ever since the development management company declared bankruptcy, remains easily accessible. The young and unemployed are not deterred by the building's grim reputation, though, with many continuing to enter it, and young graffiti artists using it for their work. Meanwhile, local residents' security concerns continue to grow. I mean, I don't blame Please. them. That's oh, terrible. Too. She has been acting weird of lately. Okay, we got the uh, classic Silent Hill fog going on. That's cool. All right, so... Silent Hill Fog, it's here in this game. That's good. Yeah, I went the wrong way. <laughs> I thought the character, like, automatically sort of turns around to, like, see, like, oh, shit, is she still behind? Yes, she is, but no, it turns out, like, that's actually the way to go. She didn't turn around. It's all good. Cherry Blossoms Bloom. Within the grasp of death. With most flowers, the rot sets in. Then they fall. That's the price of new life. Not cherry blossoms, though. They bloom beautiful. They fall beautiful. <laughs> That's how I want my life to be. Yeah, but you're not a cherry blossom, though. I have to find her. 
She is very talented, though. I'll give her that. Like, very beautiful pieces. Very nice. Uh, she's definitely got the artist's touch. That's a scary-looking Japanese door with, like, charm things on it. Maybe not that way. Can we go this way? All right, music's, music's starting to pick up. Music's getting a little bit spooky. So I suppose we have to go back out into scary hallway. Let's do that. And of course it's changed. Monster. It's gone. Right? Where is the studio? Dude, the atmosphere of this is gorgeous. Like gorgeous. In in the most darkest, unsettling, disturbing way possible. The uh, the immersion here is top fucking notch. Inside the fog of social media are ah, very true, very true. Solitude and anxiety in teenagers. All of the teenagers interviewed said they were ashamed of the resqueak, resque, resque. That's French word, and I don't know it. Selfies they posted online. Uh, they also claimed they experienced anxiety over not getting any likes on such photos. Very true. Tackling some very real themes here, Silent Hill. What all of the kids had in common was extremely low self-esteem. The greater their anxiety and lower their confidence, the more pronounced their reactions were to positive attention. The sense of fulfillment they experienced after getting a like online is difficult for adults to comprehend. Very, like, very, <laughs> very true. Although my mum's a bit of a uh, engagement fiend. Yeah, you, you, you know you get excited when, when that like status hits 60, mum. You know you do. You know, when you see that fresh 60, you're like, Oh, we're having casserole tonight. So don't pretend like you don't know what that, that feeling's like, mum. You know what that fucking feeling's like. Furthermore, even when acknowledged, the teenagers still could not view their actions positively and quickly reverted to despair, seeking more attention to fill the void. Teenagers who are not yet physiologically mature run the risk of experiencing this toxic quest for validation. What a way to put it. Toxic quest for validation, man. That that's a that's a pretty good way to uh to put it. Um Alright, so again, Silent Hill Fog. Uh hey, what's going on, Orange? Uh, shortly before the state of play, uh, I started I gave a dono, and you never actually... Oh, my bad, dude. Hold on. Let me scroll down. Oh, yes. I see it. I see it. Uh, what did Barrett say when he walked in on Tifa? Get your head out of the cloud. <laughs> Her response. That's rude. How about you give us some... Aerith. <laughs> never change, Orange. Always stay the same, man. <laughs> it's pretty good, to be fair. It's pretty good. Okay, um, I should probably go back. Seen slash heard that one before? In this chat, I believe. Oh, oh, too true. Thank you, thank you for letting me know, Tricks. I can't keep up. I just, like, with the amount of content that gets piled into this chat sometimes, over the course of time. <laughs> That's impressive that you remember that, though. You must have a good memory. Damn, okay. Eesh. Not good. I'm gonna yabber on about this atmosphere because, like, Jesus, man. Konami. I don't know if it's weird that I find this, like, cozy. <laughs> but honestly, man, like, I find this kind of shit, like, real cozy. Dark, gloomy, foggy. I actually grew up um, in a city where every single winter, like in the morning, it's just constant fog. So that might have a part to play in regards to that. Trash room? Oh, <laughs> let me in, dude. That's my room. Don't worry, I, I do love myself. I'm just fibbing. I'm just joking. It can be selective memory, though, but when it kicks in... It kicks in! No, I feel you on that. I'm selective, but probably for the stupidest things and things that, like, don't actually matter. <laughs> Creepy. Maya. I hope you're alright. 
this building really is just one big canvas for those young whippersnappers. Hey, but at least they're coming out with some, like, cool shit, man. There's a cool little, like, astronaut on a snowboard or something? On a rocket board? I don't know. He's, he's on something. Emily, oh my god. What? Thought any more about college? I am being chased by a demon, okay, with sexy stockings. And, I don't know, there's branches or something growing out of her. And, and I'm in an abandoned building. And you're talking to me about fucking college. I don't have time for this. No, oh, back the fuck up, Emily. You don't... J J She's kind of parenting me a little bit. I don't... I don't like this. No, she's actually been a good friend, alright? Okay, she... she's... You're way too exact. Yeah, be proud of me. Okay, Emily. All right, you're starting to warm up to me. You're starting to warm up to me. Wait, what about those drawings you showed me? What drawings? You could audit an art class. It could lead to a job. Whoa. Okay. Sensitive subject. Sensitive subject. Emily doesn't get it. Gotcha. So he don't really like this place. I get it. People in this town see graffiti as nothing but trashy doodles. Well, those people have no taste. No taste. And my classmates talk about me. Yeah, I don't like this live action Might stuff. Not be a bad idea to leave town, actually. The great thing about graffiti is the world's your canvas. True. And as long as I'm with you. I can have fun anywhere. Like, you know, if a graffiti artist comes up to me and starts, like, um, drawing on my forehead, it's like, hey, I, c I can't do anything about it. The world is your canvas. If you want to use my forehead, go hard, bro. All good. I, I totally get it. Committed to the cause. I respect what you're doing. It's fine. Eh, <laughs> burger. It's a burger with eyes. That's kind of cute. I like that. All right, demon lady, stick him up. I hope this isn't the new PT. I hope the new Silent Hills actually comes out. We know that there are at least, like aside from Silent Hill 2 Remake, I think there's like two other Silent Hill games that are currently in development, fully fledged ones. I don't believe that this here is um, the demo for a Silent Hill game. I think this is just its own self-contained thing within the Silent Hill universe. Uh, that is, I don't know, serving more of the purpose of being like a tech demo, but has its own little mini narrative. Maya, Just to kind of show like maybe what new Silent Hill is going to sort of look like in that sense. The engine and how it will play and all that kind of thing. Is this I thought that was a dead cat, it's a rubbish bag. I I'm I'm good. I'm good. That kind of startled me a little bit. Sorry, I'm just kind of trying to take everything in. I'm just basking in the glory of this HD stew pot right here. Looks gorgeous. I always do this, though. I always like to, like, take in the environment. Are these Maya sketches? These aren't even finished. Beautiful. And they look this good. She's good. Yeah, she's good. They seem happy. Which I'm assuming we are not. A new life. Uh-huh. Mm. Maya? Are you in, we, yeah, I, yeah, we, we need to go. It's time to leave. Did she reply? Where are you? Yeah, there's a good chance. <laughs> I don't want to alarm you or anything, but yeah, it, it, there's... Yo, did you just... Did you... Oh my god. Did you see how that uh, cloth just fell in real time and, like, folded up the way it folded up? 
with it with its crinkles and its creases yo technology is going in insane directions man it's beautiful who did maya have in mind i feel like this is going to be a blair you know witch ass ending i know so disappointing right i like blair witch and like its atmosphere and all that kind of thing but the ending the ending <laughs> Oh my god. Does that mean to be like Twitter? You tell me to smile more. Well, how's this for Yeah, this game is pretty in touch. <laughs> yeah, this is in, in like incredibly meta. All right, catch you later, Brenda. Thanks so much for uh, coming down to the stream, man. Appreciate it. I'm sorry. You have your own situation to deal with. I was out of line. Yeah, thank you, Emily. Wait, no, Anita? Wait, no, who are we are Anita? I'm I'm confusion. I guess I haven't accepted Maya's death yet. Uh, huh? Why oh. did she jump from the villa? Why did she have to die? Maya's dead? Yeah, the crazy comment is starting to look uh, pretty promising Maya's right about now. Really dead? Oh right, that was uh memorial thing uh, how how could i forget that are you all right anita yeah pretty much tricks <laughs> hello absolutely and who's this find it what am i looking for a hot dog Tuna sandwich? What do you want me to find? So naturally, um, as curiosity goes, we do be uh, shitting, but uh, we're we're gonna just continue to look for this person anyway because you know that's uh, that that do be horror game or horror movie. Main protagonist never gives up. So let's go, dude. Bring it on, man. Wait, what's going on? What are we running from? Why are we panicking? You know shit's about to go down when the character starts like running, like the movement speed doubles. I don't know what we're running from. <laughs> what are we worried about? Oh, okay, that's a fence. The fence is moving. Should we go in there? Probably not. Hey, that's a fence. Let's go this way. What's happening? What Intense music? Ah! Those are stilettos! Ah! Move, 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 move. Keep moving. Keep. I don't know what it is. Could be a spider. I don't know. But I think it's the sexy demon lady. Ah! Ah! Wait, what the fuck is that? Is that marshmallow? Stairs! Stairs! Came out of fucking nowhere! Oh. 
Smile. <laughs> I'm trying, man. <laughs> the sexy demon lady is. She wants my nuts. I think, like, you need some medication if, if this is what you're experiencing with inside of your head. Like, th this, th that is not normal. That's, that is not, I feel so bad for you. Like, no one is ever going to notice me. Shocking. She wanted to ask you about your this car's extended <laughs> warranty. <laughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? No, don't, 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 don't. Stop. 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 Maybe. We can sit down, we can have a hot cup of coke. Don't do it! Here goes. Don't do it! Stop! Stop! Don't, no, don't! Don't do it! Don't, don't do it! Please don't do it! Don't do it! Just think about this. You're gonna hurt everyone around you. Don't do it! No! So much life! You had so much life! Why did you- Fuck! I've been playing this for like, not even an hour, and I'm already invested in these characters. I give a shit. Damn. Whoa. Hey, Deshaun, a what's going on, dude? A game? <laughs> Thank you so much, man, uh, for, like, your support recently has just been, like, out of this world. Thank you. Okay, so wait, what the fuck is going on here? You find it? Find what? Yeah, what are you talking about? They are big on their warnings, too, which, like, again, I do appreciate, but, like, at the same time, as well, like, you've already warned me two times, and I think at this point, like, if someone was feeling so uncomfortable that they just couldn't play the game, they wouldn't have gotten as far as the jump off the building bit. Um, anyway, anyway, it, it's nice that they've got the warnings here. Can't leave till you find it. This really you might- can't leave till you can't- okay, it's just Maya's dead, you're not her. Can't leave till you find it. There it is. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? <laughs> Can't leave till you find it. <laughs> Modern day troll, eh? So we can't die though. We got we got that. We got that power, man. Alright, we're going back again. Oh no. My battery. Oh shit. we wh what? Is this different? I might be tripping, but like that, that seems different. That actually seems different. Okay, so we go back in time, but our phone's battery doesn't. <laughs> all right, that's all good. That's actually not all good. I'm not gonna be able to see shit. Oh yeah, new writing, bad girl gets an empty plane. But I'm hungry. I can't see donkey nuts, man. It's no such thing as uh, too much kind of takes you out of it. True, true. It's all your fault. Is this the sort of thing where it's just progressively going to get more and more fucked up? I mean, that is sort of like Silent Hill in a nutshell. I don't have light this time around, though. That makes me feel um, vulnerable. Like, really vulnerable. Give me lamp. Oh. It's all your okay. Yeah, no stuff is changing. Uh, what? Who do this? 
yeah, what we're piecing together here is Maya um, definitely came from not a great family scene. So I guess we're going to be learning a little bit about Maya, why she did what she did. Poor Maya. Poor Maya. I'm just going to quickly walk down here, see if there's, you know, any anything special. Could that perhaps maybe be like an interpretation of Maya's room? We can hear a girl crying. Interesting. Okay. Game just took out my fucking Wi-Fi connection. I I is that an in-game mechanic? Hello, Mr. Baghead Man. My, uh, he... <laughs> Children, uh, who turn trauma into tales, solitude and anxiety. Uh, all of the teenagers surveyed suffered from deep psychological issues caused by past experiences. And interestingly, all of them conceptualized those issues as grandiose stories of sorts. One girl placed herself in the role of a tragic hero, convincing herself she was at the mercy of an abusive stepmother and that her loving real mother existed somewhere else. Another girl viewed her childhood scars as stigmata, believing those scars would bloom into beautiful cherry blossoms. Okay. These convenient tales in the face of extreme adversity are born out of a deep desire to escape unbearable pain and self-hatred. The greater the trauma, the more grandiose the story surrounding it. Very true. You know, whatever helps you get by in a situation like that can lead to... Uh, fantasy positions which is like incredibly sad by the way how could somebody do this <sighs> some people really have nothing better to do wait I bet it was these guys All right, fellas. Calm down. Can calm down. I mean you no harm. I'm just going to squeeze past here. Okay, sweet. Okay, so we now know... Oh, what? The floor's missing. What? Uh, okay, what happened to the floor, though? All right. Yo, nice glass effects. Someone probably spent like a month working on just the glass shard alone. It's pretty impressive. I don't know if these are different now. No. All right. This is just like before. True, true, mm-hmm, true. So we're in Silent Hill, right? The floors of fight, yeah. I mean, what, anything goes in, in Silent Hill. In the, should I say the realm of Silent Hill? This isn't actually like the OG Silent Hill. Why are you asking that? Please tell. I still can't believe she's gone either. Wish it was a lie. She seemed perfectly fine before it. Ah, yeah, they always do, man. That's the thing. Talking is important. You're so good to me, but you're leaving me behind. Book she recently read, so I feel guilty for what happened. Even if she didn't tell me anything, I should have known something was Did up. Maya really not say anything? Don't beat yourself up, Emily. Oh my god. The pain. <laughs> So what'd you think of the book? 
Yeah, I find this really jarring going from like in game to like live action. <laughs> I just wish they uh, would have done like normal cutscenes. Anywho, anywho. It's kind of enchanting, isn't it? I wonder what they were thinking right before they died. Anyway, I didn't think you'd share your thoughts in a letter. You really are shy, aren't you? <laughs> yes, yeah, stop it. Stop Actually, it. I kind of like that, though. Oh, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You write in a really loud, oh, shit! Passionate way. What's going on? I can't wait to read more. Yeah, I don't know if you should. Oh, okay. Letters. I feel like there's going to be some like really abstract kind of secrets in this small little demo thing. Um that people will eventually find in like a month or a few months time, possibly even years time. Like, a certain method of, like, doing something will activate, like, a hidden cutscene or something. Belief in the Witch of Kedinstad. Those who believe in the Witch of Kedinstad share many practices with modern Wiccans. Wiccans. Wiccan. Such as praying for a bountiful harvest and goddess worship. Got it. Got it. Got I know English. I know English. Goddess worship. What sets the practice apart is its slight bend of both Western and Eastern customs. As for what led to the mixing of customs, there is one rather creative theory. During the joint efforts of Japanese and German entrepreneurs and laborers in the 1930s to foster economic growth and prosperity, there was an exchange in cultural beliefs giving rise to the belief in witches. Oh, okay. There's a little bit of a witch theme going on here too. The classic horror altar, you know, you gotta have it. Kind of like the uh, PT witch constantly being behind you when you are able to free roam with the camera. It's giving me that kind of vibe. You don't believe in that stuff? Well, I think there's something real about it. My great grandmother was a fortune teller. I hear people here used to treat her like some sort of prophet. Man had that galaxy brain? But they all eventually turned on my great grandmother. Guess you can predict other people's futures. But not your own. Yeah, try telling that to the Master of Masters. He'll have a thing or six to say about that. No, a thing or seven. Sorry, seven to say about that. <clears throat> well, someone's good at paper cranes. I, I never could figure out the old paper crane, eh? That's still a bucket list thing. I've got a, a master at some point. <sighs> okay, um, ooh, these are new. Okay, some tarot cards. Got the star, the sun, the hanged man. What is that? The the dead, the death, death, the. I I have no idea what that one is. The chariot, chariot, chariot. I know English. The Hermie. The cast is actually like into that kind of stuff, but I don't really know anything about it, so I don't know what any of that means. Uh-oh. If if you want food, do what I say. That is terrible. That is... That's fucking terrible, man. I th I'm about to whip out my salami stick and slam it on the desk in frustration over how this mother treated her fucking daughter, man. I've had it up to about here, but wait until I get to about here, man. Shit's gonna go down. 
In Japanese culture, there uh, has been there has long been a sense of beauty in sacrifice, with harakiri killing oneself by slicing one's stomach. Jesus, okay, being a prime example. The idea was that by taking your own life, you symbolically purge the world of your transgressions and purify yourself. That is madness. Like madness. This concept can be confusing to many Westerners, no shit, uh, with young people incorrectly assuming the Japanese yearn for a beautiful way to die. Modern Japanese people, however, do not view suicide in such a positive light anymore, and the life they value is not the biological variety, but rather a social one where death is needed to protect that life. Oh my god. Okay. Hey, did you give your child an eating dish? Exactly. Yeah, I did. She, she needs the. Someone needs to call Sifts. Whoa, hold on a minute. Oh, okay. I'm just now, like, kind of thinking, you know, like, everything we're coming across that represents the trauma and the pain that Maya went through. We can now go into the trash room or this. Let's go into the trash room. So, like, when I see a boarded-up door, was her room boarded up or something like that, or... Oh, these roaches. Oh, it's... <clears throat> oh, fucking Benny. Benny and his... pork chops that he just... Is that, is that shit moving? That's moving. This is all your fault. Everything. You're a heartless bitch. Heartless mentioned. Heartless mentioned. You stole my only friend, my place in this world, all of it. And you don't even care. I'm invisible to you. I fucking hate you. You're not talented. You're not special. You call those shit stains art? You came out of nowhere and ruined everything. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, get the fuck out of my life, you piece of shit freak! Oh, fuck, okay, sorry, I, I have to, I've got to get into it, you know, like, I'm, that's, that's part of my job. Alright. Hello? Ring, ring? Hello? Hmm. Ah, oh, no, another dirty toilet? What's this? Deutschland, Medical University School of Medicine. Orientation. Dear incoming freshmen, welcome to Deutschland Medical University. Founded in 1709, DMU is one of Europe's oldest and most revered institutions. It's the state-of-the-art research facilities eagerly await your... That's arrival. Why am I pausing on that? Having a fucking, like, brain shit? Orientation details. When? September 24th, 2021. 11.30 to, uh, 2 o'clock. That's 2 o'clock. No, that's, that's 1 o'clock. I, I know time. I... My brain. Uh, where? School of Medicine, Central Lecture Hall. Please wear a mask when attending. COVID-19. To to to. Ooh, okay. I'll be dipping into Amelie's stuff now. Screen Actors uh, Guild called your award is on the <laughs> Jane, stop it, you. <laughs> hey, Anita, you got a minute to talk? Sure, what's up? <coughs> My man needs to become a voice actor. That was flawless. <laughs> Thanks, but I'm fine. Sorry to bring it up. Don't want to pry. Nah, it's okay. I don't mind. Ah, there you go. There you go. We're making some progress. Hey, we should go shopping together sometime. I haven't left my house in what feels like forever. Plus, my brother's coming here. Yeah, I'm just going to try to avoid him as much as possible. Why? Why? So shopping, yeah, we can find you something cute. Oh my god. No, I'm good. I'm not a fan of crowds. And nothing looks cute on me anyway. This girl needs to be, uh... 
lift it up. Lift it like lift it up. I'm not meaning, you know, physically. I'm meaning, you know, metaphorically. Stop talking like that. You're way too hard on yourself. You've got the looks. You just need to find the right outfit. Makes all the difference. Yes. We gotta pull back the curtain, man. I haven't been able to study since my brother came back for Christmas break. He's nice and doesn't interrupt my studies or anything, but I can't stand him staring at me. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was... I was okay. Yeah. I, uh, I was gonna say, like, why are you trying to avoid your brother? There's gotta be a reason. This is weird. I know he was probably just messing with me back then, but I've been scared of him ever since. It's made me hate any guy looking at me. I can't believe other girls walk around school in town showing so much skin. Uh, February 21st. I think I'm finally finding my study groove. My test scores are really good. I'm worried about how much my parents are fighting recently. Okay, that sucks. Uh, they were yelling at each other again today. I asked my mom why, but she wouldn't say. May 11th. This is it. Test day. Tomorrow, mum told me I should be proud of myself since I've worked so hard. So I'm feeling great. She's not my real mum, uh, but I know she loves me and I love her. Mum, I'm going to ace this test tomorrow for both you and dad. Okay. Uh, the brother thing kind of creeps me out a little bit. That's the family there. Why war happens. Sapiens. The history of sapiens. Another uh, history of sapiens. Obviously likes the sapiens. Is that Jeff the killer? Like no, no shit. Is that Jeff? That's that's motherfucking Jeff the killer. That. Correct me if I am wrong, but that is is that not Jeff the killer? I know we were memeing about Jeff the killer before, but like that is just straight up Jeff the killer. Monkey book. <laughs> Donkey Kong the book. So this is Amelie's room. That's a cute little owl. Periodic table of elements. Very nice. Uh, Jeff the Killer is uh, it's sort of like an old creepy pasta. Um, but the photo that was used for that creepy pasta looks basically almost the exact same as the face that was on that poster. So, no doubt Konami got inspiration from Jeff the Killer. Uh, it's not a real thing, it's a made-up creepypasta story. October 17th, I'm finally focused on my studies, so I think I might pull an all-nighter. Hell yeah, let's go. Won't be good for my skin, I can just hear people calling me troll and nerd. Damn, that cuts deep. Uh, but I don't care, I have to make it to college in the city. Mom and Dad are counting on me to do well, I'll make them proud by getting into my first choice. All right, time to hit the books till morning. November 9th. Dad was talking about how uh, there was a plan to rebuild the town. They were going to use a bunch of funding from China to turn the town into something better. But everything got cancelled due to COVID. We all know what that's like. <laughs> sure, it would have been nice if it had gone through, but I just couldn't see it happening. Even if things had worked out, not in this place. It hasn't been special since I was little. There's nothing to do. The buildings are ancient. It's a dump. Place stinks. My future isn't here. It's in the city where college life is waiting for me. Everything's riding on my entrance. <laughs> entrance exam next year. I have to get out before my brother comes back. Okay, yeah, the brother thing is is making me feel really fucking uncomfortable. People asking who Jeff the Killer um, is makes me feel old. Yeah, it makes me feel old. <laughs> it, I mean, it is pretty old, that means said, but I suppose it's just like one of those reminders. Stay home alone? Stay home alone. Okay, so it's a stepmom, right? That's that's what we've basically deciphered here. They need to tidy this place up, though, man. It's a fucking tip. It's a tip. What I like about this is I feel like there's a lot of like environmental details that um, can kind of give you like clues to stuff. 
Okay, I'm not going to grab that one just yet. Go over here. Also, the sound effects, too. It's kind of like when I'm walking over the paper, there is literally like a paper crunch type sound effect. And then glass, too. That's pretty cool. Nice attention to detail. I got some materials from my first choice in the mail today. I'm going to be a college freshman. I am so, so happy! I still can't believe it. Mom, Dad, I'm going to study my ass off and be the best daughter ever. Thank you so much for everything. September 22nd. Mom and Dad are yelling at each other again. They're talking about bankruptcy. Okay, that's a fair enough reason to be yelling at each other. Just, like, you know, don't... Don't do anything stupid. Uh, wasn't everything supposed to work out even without that rebuilding plan? So this means they're out of money, right? Does this mean I can't go to college? All that hard work was for nothing? No way. Don't leave me, Mom. I can't stay here. I can't be stuck here with my brother. Uh, September 23rd, Mom just left. Mom just left. She told me to get out of the way. I have to get out of here. I want to disappear. But where would I go? This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. This is all a bad dream. Amelie hated the way her brother looked at her. I bet she wants to leave to get away from all that. Yeah, the brother sounds like a bit of a weirdo. Oh, God. Young student found dead. Possible suicide. September 25th. Okay. Yeah. Um, at around 10 a.m. on the 24th, a local resident reported seeing an 18-year-old female high school student fall from the roof of Kedinstad apartment building. The girl was rushed to the hospital, but was pronounced dead two hours later. According to school staff, the girl was distraught over not being able to attend college due to troubles at home. No note or diary was found, but police still believe her death may be suicide. Amelie's not like this, though. That's kind of what, like, we I... just did. Did we, like... Were we walking in her shoes? Or, like, did we relive... Or live, like, through her death? Is that what happened? Gat yeah, dang, okay. We're starting to, you know, build a bit of a picture here. It's open now. Ooh, and that looks like a relatively tidy, white, clean room. But what if I go back down this way? The way we originally went. I just noticed, too, our phone's back on. I, I've literally only just noticed that. So observant, Jared. I can hear humming. Maya? It's a CB on the door. Maya? Ring, ring, hello? It, 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 uh, I don't know if you're a ghost or a demon or a hallucination, but it's me. I'm alone, and I would like a hug right now. Maya? Okay, interesting. Well, it was worth coming down here, I guess. I keep fucking standing on stuff, and it, the noise is freaking me out. <laughs> Oh, we're at school. <laughs> nice. School. Yeah, I'm the uh, I'm the same with you, Deshaun. I've never. I, I briefly played the very first Silent Hill on PlayStation One. I actually played that when I was really young. Um, ah, instead of Supreme, it says Spacey. Nice. Um. I obviously didn't, like, click with it being as young as I was when I played it. But otherwise, it's it's a series that's always intrigued me a lot. And then, obviously, with the PT wave, when that came out back in the day, um, it super intrigued me. Like, super intrigued me. And ever since, like, I've got the games, too. I've got um, all of the PS2 games. I've always wanted to uh, dive into the series. I love horror, weird, creepy shit. Um, it's one of my favorite genres. So And, like, obviously, Silent Hill is... Right up there with all that kind of stuff. 
Ratchet and Clank Jam went hot. You know I only picked the best jams. Strictly OG though. <laughs> Absolutely, man. Someone just throw a shoe at me? There's gonna be a spitball any second. Possibly a wedgie. Someone just threw a bottle of Sprite at me. Well, joke's on you. Sprite's my favorite fizzy drink. Which? Freedom. No wonder nobody likes you at school. This is, like, awful, man. Actually shocking. Can, can you guys, like, can you just, please, can you move? Can you move, please? I need to get, your ass is huge, and I can't get past it. I'll just walk now. Okay, I can't. You want me to sit down? Am I going to class? No? They're all laughing at me. <laughs> Stop! I can't even drink water. I'm that nervous. Same OG Silent Hill on PS1 as a gaming baby and dying when the tear <laughs> attack till they come through the glass window. <laughs> yeah. I know what you're saying, yeah, and like at that moment I'm like, I'm I'm good. I I, I want to play Spyro too now. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly it, tricks. That's exactly it. Oh, okay, right. I've got to get into my locker. That makes sense. What the hell? Get out, you freak, slut! Your art's fucking you a freak. God, you piece of shit. Jesus. So again, this we must be living through Maya's point of view. I'm I'm assuming oh my god. Jesus Christ. $600 camera. Oh no, dude. Oh no. Yo, okay, hold on. Give me a sec. I just fucked up my camera. Oh shit. I j oh my god, I've just fucked up my camera. I literally, I've just. I just went barbarian mode on my camera. My strength level is beyond 962. And I forgot about that. Damn it. Um. Oh, shit. Oh, no, dude. <laughs> I'm actually laughing in pain, by the way. I'm not like laughing, laughing. I'm actually, I'm, I'm dying on the inside. I'm just keeping a, a happy face on because, because we're live. That's a tech issue I can't fix. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hold on, dudes. Oh man, um, shit. <laughs> How hard did I hit it? Oh, you know, I gave it a king hit. Yeah, I gave it a king hit. Okay, the good news is the camera is actually not fucked, but the um, mini HDMI cable 
basically snapped off, and the input of that is stuck inside the camera. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm dying. I'm we lost all vision. <laughs> oh no, dude. Never go silverback mode. Uh, hey, he fucking called me a whore. I ain't gonna just take that. I'm gonna stick up for Anita. You know, like, damn. Shit, man. Talk shit, get hit. And they say it's just a video game. I mean, I take my video games real seriously. Just a video game? Nah, man, this is real life. People like that, they need to work. Oh, damn, we, we are, like, full-on out of business here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I showed up at the wrong time. <laughs> you could say this is the right time. There is PlayStation 5, VIP 9, I lied. It's back. Hello. <laughs> so I have to switch to my webcam. What? Na 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 Oh my fucking god Bro 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 What the fuck 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 what the fuck? 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 Mom! Yes. I'm not even fucking around this time. We're going to Hawaii. I can't hear you. Hang on. Where are you? I'm still in the car. I'm, I'm not far. I'm just going to pop into a shop in uh, Fashion Island. Okay, forget that. Forget we're going to Hawaii. Oh, yeah, I've heard this before. You don't believe me? Oh. I don't believe you. You're pulling my leg. Oh, okay. Well, what about Waihee? We can go to Waihee. I'd rather go to Waihiki. Oh, yeah, we can go We can go back to Waihiki. That's all right. Yeah, all right. Well, you book it and we'll be there. All right, cool. Sweet. I can organize that. Awesome. All right, I love you lots. Yeah. Okay, you too. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, blank. Oh my god, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> um, Jesus Christ. Uh, I haven't seen a dono like this in a long ass time. Like, there's obviously been some insane support um, over the past few years, but like, this this is sending me back to like the early days of streaming. Um, another year, another streaming scuff. Fucking oath. That is absolutely fucking insane, though. Like, that. that's like beyond. I mean, in the most positive way possible, but like that—that that is, that's just like I'm tweaking, brother. I'm like I'm full on. I'm on the tweak. I <laughs> um, holy shit, though. You have no idea how much something like that helps me. So, like, thank you. Like for real, for real. Thank you so much proper insanity and shout out to Deshaun as well just say you're playing uh 
Just say you're playing in the dark for the spookiness. Oh man, I would love to, but the curtains in here, I, I would totally close it all up. We usually do that when we play the spooky games, but the, the curtains in here are like all white curtains. There's some black, but the rest of them, half of them are white, so the fucking the light comes through. It sucks. I wish I could do the spookiness atmosphere. Um, for real though, Blank, um, Deshaun, everyone that's showing like support and stuff, uh, as I always say though, even if it's not like donos or subs, thank you guys. Like, legit, fucking honestly, thank you. Like, it just, in, uh, <laughs> going back to like ape form. Uh, I'm gonna have to hopefully, I'll show you what happens though, real quick. Um, with the cable. <laughs> Dude, look at this shit. Look at this shit. I honestly don't even know how that... Well, I, I do know how it happened. I, I can't hit my um, camera, but... See that? So, like... <laughs> the actual input piece has, like... Oh, you can't, because it won't focus. But the, uh, the input piece fully fucking snapped off, and that's now inside... <coughs> My almost two grand um, camera, so hopefully I can get that out because that's my actual like DSLR. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing about it. I will have to fix that after the stream. Okay, okay, let's get back into it. Blank, thank you so much. Like fucking in, like I don't even know like what to do. I don't know if I should like chuck an an airbag underneath my computer chair and then activate it and then fly through the roof and like deal with it that way I just I've got no fucking idea I've, it's just proper insanity man proper insanity damn the, the frame rate also tanks with all this bullying going on like is that part of the the gig yeah I should be able to get it out with some tweezers I'm also I'm gonna have to go down to um PB Tech tomorrow and get another cable. <laughs> Fuck. Hey yo, it was it was it was worth it for the I don't know the clip. God damn, this is horrendous. The hallway's all twisty. Is this Kingdom Hearts 4 gameplay teaser? Well, we are in a modern looking. Oh my god, it is getting like hard to look at. We are in a modern building. I gotta say, the immersion factor of this game is ridiculous. Like, ridiculous. Also, um, Blank, you've just reminded me, I gotta update, uh, the MVP list. I can't remember if you're already on there, but I definitely do need to add some additional people onto that. I haven't updated that in such a long time. So, I will be sure to do that after the stream. This game reminds me of my sleep paralysis team. Ah! Oh, fuck. she's kind of hot though. Like, kind of, kind of hot. Sorry, I wasn't even looking at the screen. <laughs> okay, all right. This time, it's okay. I've got the big gorilla nipples out. I'm good. I'm. We're gonna get through this easy. Hey, oh, she kind of bad. Exactly. She kind of sexy. Go. This way? This way. We'll go this way. Yep. 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 Sorry, I'm shaking the camera for extra immersion. Okay, not that way. I think we went the wrong way. Just keep running. Just keep running. Just keep running. Think of uh, freshly baked donuts. Freshly baked donuts. Stupid. No, don't be... This way! Uh, I don't like all these eyes. The eyes are kind of creeping me out a little bit. What's the bit? There's probably like a secret door somewhere here. Oh my god. Go. Go. Wrong way. This way. Open the door. Run. Oh my god. Yep, yep, surely this is the right way, right? No? Did we just do a loop? We just did a loop. 
We just did a fucking loop. That was a loop. I don't know if that's a door. I'm not going to try it because then it's a dead end. I'm going to go back. This way. This way. This way. That's just a loop. That's just a loop. I don't know where the demon is. Ah! That's the demon. Open the door. It's not hard to turn a knob. I don't know if that's a door up there. Fuck it, I'm just gonna try it. I'm just gonna try it. Yeah, it is. It is. It is. It is. Turn. Turn. This is it. We're safe. Okay. The hallways feel like they're closing in. Yeah, anyone that, like, struggles with claustrophobia, I would not recommend this. <laughs> find it i just like what what it fine <laughs> oh my god i don't know what you mean though like, what are you talking about what do you mean thank you my thoughts exactly i do i don't know what you're talking about Okay, I can't examine any of these. I mean, I already have. Ooh, rubbish. Ooh, shit. Pregnancy test positive. Okay. She was pregnant? Maybe she's uh, telling us to find the Kingdom Hearts for release date. Well, in that case, dude, we're going to be running through these hallways from this Square Enix Konami demon for the next coming, like, two years. Oh. It is. Mmm. Fine, I've had to guess what to find. Another painting or not. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Oh, this is Maya's diary. I haven't really been in a good mood since this morning. I tried to lose myself in my graffiti, but I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because Mum and I argued this morning. Probably not. We've clashed before. I've known for a long time we value different things. Is it because my classmates tease me? I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone. It's got to be because I lost that special person and the hope he gave me, right? Why do I feel like this? I've never felt like this before. Big bad breakup? Something? Okay, well, we looked at the... Or maybe we've got to look at this one. No? Okay. Very pretty, you know, minus all the black splotches. What's going on, uh, Kao Mick? How, <laughs> how it feels to be playing a gutted version of PNPT? I mean, you're not wrong. It won't open. Let me out? It won't open. Let me out? It's I Yeah, I know, it's but locked. I... Okay, I get that. It's I uh, Yeah, I, I want to... I want to, I don't want to be stuck in here, man. It smells like stale salmon. We'll say, just off fish. It, uh, uh. Oh, okay, right. That makes sense. <clears throat> There'll be an additional sketch now. This guy looks familiar. Oh, she actually was wearing that bracelet, too. I really hope some dude What's didn't that? ditch her as soon as she got pregnant, and that's why everyone in the school was an asshole to her. Kind of seems like it's going that way. Come closer, then. Like the whole horse slut thing, um, could potentially be pointing towards that sort of a thing. Stop by any 
time. You're always welcome. <laughs> I was kind of half expecting her model to be like um, a computer generated one. <laughs> and she's like still a real life actor. Thank God they didn't do that. That would be very jarring. Okay, slowly uh, stitching the pieces together. We're painting a bit of a picture here. No longer locked, right? Right? Ah, the demon has let me out, and we are now in the library. Mm-hmm, so mm-hmm. Yo, these graphics are insane, man. Oh, uh, sorry. I was just thinking about PlayStation 10 be like. I borrowed that book you wanted. I actually I do think that the live action segments do have a little bit of uh, CGI in them. Like the surrounding environments and all that kind of thing. At least some of the environment. My impressions in a letter. Read it when you get home, okay? Because, like, I feel like developers now can make pretty convincing backdrops and environments. Um, but in regards to, like, actual, uh, like, humans and stuff like that. You can still tell, even though it's it's kind of getting to the point where it is hard, but you can still tell um, what's real and what's not. <laughs> where was it? That book. Like this library, for example, is pretty good looking, man. Look at this next generation library, man. Sabbath? Centuries? Okay, there's some, yeah, like, witchy shit going on here, dude. Kennedstad, the town cursed by a witch. Kennedstad continues to see a rapid decline in its population. The birth rate is at a mere 0 0.7, less than half of the German nation, average 1.6. Miscarriages are also at 31%, more than the double average, 15%. The economy is in shambles, and the once booming industrial city has failed to revitalize itself twice. God damn, okay. A number of researchers studying the occult point to a witch as the cause of the economic downturn in Kennedstad. The witch was a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance to influence economic development in the town in the 1930s. Researchers believe she was hunted down and killed before her death. She is believed to have a place to have placed uh, a curse on the town. St stimming? Uh, these are uh, honestly some of these were I've never seen in my life. Stymieing? Stymieing? That, that was the... It's growth. Okay. So, is so the cursed. town is cursed? But why me? <clears throat> why do I have to be cursed like this? Stymieing. Stymieing. So like stagnating? That kind of thing? Words are hard. Ah, oh, stop with the, this find it nonsense, man. Right, right. Stay me in. I learned something today. <laughs> Find what in a place like this? Hard out, man. It's like finding a bubba buoy in a haystack. Britain. Lots of books on Britain. I suppose this is a European library. That would make sense. UE5 is coming for Uncanny Valley Sensor. <laughs> yeah. Looks like there's space for a book here. Wait. Ooh. Uh. Oh, I thought we were going to do like the Kingdom Hearts 1 Holobastion Library puzzle thing. Sapiens. It's the Sapien Monkey Book. 
Oh wait, so I gotta go back to the locker? We've got the boat? Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, what, what this? What this? The witch hunt of Kennenstad. In the 1930s Germany, the, the town of Kennenstad attracted wealthy entrepreneurs and enjoyed a period of economic prosperity. Behind the scenes, though, was supposedly a Japanese woman who used her clairvoyance and mystical powers to guide the entrepreneurs. She would come to be known as the Witch of the Far East and would be greatly respected by the German people. However, in 1947, the entrepreneurs suffered great losses. A large fire spread throughout the industry industrial parks losing them the majority of their factories the witch of the far east who was hospitalized jumped off the roof of the hospital and killed herself the witch has been diagnosed with an unknown illness and many believe the fires pushed her over the edge some citizens however claimed the witch hunt was to blame they argued the witch's rise to prominence angered the mayor's party who used the chaos from the fires as a cover for murder. There is no evidence to support this claim, and many now view it as a mere conspiracy theory, but the mayor's party did manage to regain influence in the town after the witch's death. Since then, citizens have started to believe any stroke of bad luck is a result of the witch's curse. Is that why I saw what I did before? Modern eating habits. Hmm. So, what curse has been placed on me where I can't read English? My great-great-great-grandpappy must have stolen a pig back in the day or something. And the local witch must have cursed him to be like, Future generations will not know how to read the normal language properly. Fuck you, great-great-great-grandpappy. The curse is called dyslexia. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I've never been tested, but like, yeah, it, it, there's a chance, I guess. <laughs> and a great, yes, yes. I actually know many people that have dyslexia. Yeah, maybe I should look into that. <laughs> but she said she was oak. Ah, reg flag number one, man. Come on. It's hard, though, when someone doesn't want to be helped, right? Someone needs to come and clean these fucking walls. They are disgusting. I did a test online, got a 75% score, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe I should... <laughs> Honestly, maybe I should look into that. Just to, um... You know, uh... Do a little bit of uh, self-discovering... Of sorts? I don't Maybe? 26 years, I had no it fucking idea. <laughs> Wait, so we gotta find another one. Uh huh. My locker. Just waiting for the time you what open one of about? these doors and camera pans Seriously. up to a mad jump scare. I, I mean, possibly, right? But there's no way I will freak out. It's very hard to scare me. What? Oh no. Uh, what? Okay, we gotta find liar. Okay, that just says liar. We have to find a combination. Aha! There's a two? That's a zero? Uh. One, zero, two, 
one zero two 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 three on the roof oh okay one oh three two one oh three two thank you James you got a keen eye there dude Okay, hold on. One, zero, three, two. So why don't we go two, one, zero, three, two, one, zero, three. Two, three, zero, one, two, three, zero, one. No. Two one. One o oh, three two. One o oh, three two. Twenty thirteen. That could be the year they went. Zero one two three. Yeah, that's a pretty good point. Zero one two three. Or three two one zero. That would have been so funny, like in in the form of a jump scare. It's like it's counting down, and you open it up, fucking jump scare. Check the disc again. Yeah. Oh, wait, the colors. The colors. Hold on, the colors. Black, red, yellow, blue. Black, red, yellow, blue. That's the order. Black, red, 0312. 0312. There we go. Very good. Nice. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> I apologize, Shadow. Is it inside the book? Remember when I said I wanted to live like a cherry blossom? Thank you. I don't have to read it out. To be beautiful and dignified for a fleeting moment. Simply by letting go of life. Daring to bloom, knowing it won't last. And so falling in vivid color. I wish I could live like that. I want to experience true beauty, if only for a moment. I met someone who made me feel different. He showed me a whole new world, gave me hope. I honestly thought he could help me find a new me. I felt it with all my heart. She was pretty into the sky. People didn't understand us. Didn't want that from us. In the end, they took my hope from me. They took him away. People People who can't achieve beauty seek comfort in others. They fear anyone different. Hate them. Try to tear them down. This music. <laughs> I can't take much more of this. I wish you and I had... I wish you and I could run away together. Hmm, okay. Maya. She was asking. 
asking Amelie for help. But I just... Uh... Maya, you have everything. You're way more talented than me. So why? Why take Amelie from me? You acted like I wasn't even there. Amelie is my friend. She's mine! Uh, I, I only oh, okay. to her down a bit. She, she was taking Amelie away from me. She wouldn't pay attention to me. A little bit of uh, jealousy soup going on. Damn, dude. Okay, this this is kind of this is a little bit deep, man. This music is the sound that death comes out. Sounds like death's. All oh, right, we're back in the game. Death's uh, theme song or ambient sounds for sure. Sounds like someone's breathing down my neck. I love that. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> There's me thinking, like, when she jumped off the building, um, that the game was, like, done. I'm like, okay, that really was a short message. But, uh, it's actually surprising to know how much is in this for a free experience. Here we go again! Here we go again! Alright, sexy legs, show yourself! Okay, not that way. We're not gonna go that way this time. Okay, I think- ah! OH MY GOD, MONKEY NIPPLES! Should've- should've just gone through the fucking door- should've just- gone through the door, man! Baboon? 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 Ginger biscuits! Ah, uh, you. Oh, uh, yeah, nah. You, she, she, fuck, she moves, man. She is quick. Super fucking quick. Okay, um. Yeah, it's got to be this way. This is the door she came out of. It's got to be this way. Has to be this way. This demon does not skip leg day because it's like fully... Oh my god, don't look behind. Just keep moving. What? Do you just teleport? Oh shit. Oh my god. Go, go, go. I'm gonna go this way, I'm gonna go this way. I don't even know where I'm going. My GPS is down. Okay, stairs. Stairs are good. Stairs are good. Okay, thank god. Holy shit. read about it before when I was more self-conscious and anxious, but not anymore. Just impossible for me to find a psychiatrist in my area trains to test their dogs for autism. Maya. Chances are you have nightmares. I finally get it. Yeah, the nightmare uh, spectrum here is looking very broad. Like, uh, my dreams tonight are going to be incredibly interesting, although if it's that demon, Anya, no complaints. <laughs> Honestly, dude, no complaints if it's that demon. I'm crazy for playing this. Hey, you know me, man. Because I killed her. 
You know what I mean? <laughs> Stop. We've already been through this once. Don't. Okay, come on, man. We've already. We've done this once. You. It's. No, 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 no. Don't. I. Uh, it. You know, you're just gonna go back to the beginning again. You were just gonna go. We. The reason why you travel back in time is to do things differently, right? You're obviously not doing something right, so you were sent back and there we go. We have to overcome something, and you keep. Keeping on jumping off is, is not doing anything. It's gonna be uh, full as fuck. Got Grand Blue, blah, 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 Grand Blue Relink and Persona 3 and Rebirth. I know, dude. It's stacked. We're eating so well at the moment. I remember watching your Jimmy the Squeaker videos on YouTube. Dude, that's a throwback. <laughs> That is a throwback. Welcome to the uh, stream for the first time, man. Even if I die, this doesn't end. How many times do I have to go through this? You could maybe, like, not die. That way we can, like, avoid the whole going back thing, you know, like, all together. Find it. Just still on this find it meme. Why won't you say anything? Can you tell me what? Can you please specify? Like, I. <laughs> Am I looking for a bread loaf? Alright, what do we got here? February 4th. I ended up heading to the roof of the villa. Couldn't help but think of the girl who jumped to her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teens, supposedly. Now the place is a famous spot for people who kill themselves. Looking down from the roof, I could see how high up I was. The thought of a light breeze sending me flying made me feel a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Were they jumping away from something or to something? Dun, dun, dun. Very good point. Why? 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 All the big games coming out as of right now? Absolutely. Yeah, it's kind of like start of the year, all the good stuff comes out up until like April kind of thing. Then it's like a little bit quiet and then end of the year picks up again. Don't you dare go outside. There's way more babies in this trolley now too. Therapy equals goat. 100%. I have done a little bit myself, and it has helped tremendously. So I definitely do recommend it to anyone that might be considering it. They just need that extra push, that kind of a thing. Um, it's helped me out tremendously. So big recommends there, man. And for any reason, too. Literally any reason. Whatever the reason might be, as I was saying before, it is always a good idea to talk to someone. So I don't mean to go all sappy and soft and gooey and stuff like that, but like, we are playing a message that's kind of, we are playing a message, we are playing a game that's sort of surrounding that whole like, message, um, the sensitive topics and whatnot of abuse and all that kind of thing. It really is incredibly helpful to talk. Talking is everything, man. The Silent Hill Phenomenon. The suicide rate has increased around the world, in large part due to the struggles brought on by the COVID-19 pandemic, with countries still unsure how best to handle the issue. 
these trying times have also given rise to a strange phenomenon in many areas. Those affected suddenly claim to see fog even on fair weather days, and lose consciousness shortly after. This has come to be known as the Silent Hill Phenomenon, named after a similar event that occurred in an eponym epi ep eponymous? 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 Bro, these guys are whipping out, like, the, the crazy big words, man. I'm not that far through school. Um, just had to double-check that was actually a word. <laughs> U.S. Town. The first to propose a theory explaining why this could be happening is Dr. XXX, a social psychologist at XXX University, who had the following to say on the matter. To one who is physiologically unstable, fog represents uncertainty, uncertainty and sensory illusions. When in a state of high stress, one's vision may become obscured or tunneled, as if one is wandering through a dense fog or mist. Societal uncertainty or apprehension about the future manifests as fog, thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. As time goes on, we are seeing more and more cases of the Silent Hill phenomenon. In response, Dr. XXX calls for a rapid rebuilding of society, as well as a stronger emphasis on counseling and mental health care for the young. So that basically gives you, like, a breakdown on the whole Silent Hill um, realm. Uh, it's basically one big trip out uh, brought on by the fears, the worries of the individual. Uh, games and movies, thank you so much for the 200 uh, bitterinos, man. I just had Panda Express for dinner. So much orange chicken, so good. I wish we had Panda Express here uh, in my country. I've always heard good things about, like, orange chicken as well. Definitely got to try it at some point. Wait, I am going the right way, right? Yeah, okay, this way. How do we feel um, about protagonists in Silent Hill who are partially responsible for their torment? I mean, that's kind of it. It's sort of that that sort of situation of like, do they deserve it? Does someone deserve to go through the extremities of seeing demons um, and things tormented in front of them, depending on the actions that they were involved in, the actions they did? I mean, I don't, I don't know, right? I mean, if you've done some horrible shit, I, I guess you kind of deserve this sort of thing, right? <laughs> uh, I finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought my happily ever after... I found my happily ever after, but it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost everything. I still have my children, my cute little angels. Okay. Creepy children's drawings? blurred face too that's always like a red flag horror trope you don't need to take a poo and eater no you good all right cool sweet no time for toilet breaks man did we didn't we just we just okay it's is it doing like the pt thing now drama <laughs> My new man showed up to my place today with pizza. Children definitely need a father, but they still won't take to him. Uh, he looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. My daughter drew a picture of our family with smiling and holding hands. I wish she would have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She is slower than other kids her age. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. Okay. That is a nice HD creek. I'm giving up my life for you. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands from the new place he was raving about. My daughter hated the pizza, though. She's extremely picky. I mean, fair enough, though, if it had, like, fucking pineapples on it, man. I, I wouldn't touch it either if it had pineapples. So, fair enough. 
I should probably teach her to eat things she doesn't like. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. The kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with him. Maybe uh, we need we need him happy. <laughs> My brain is on fire! <laughs> we need him happy. We need him... Oh! We need him for a happy life. And I need them to realize that! I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. Uh, he told me the banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind! If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with him? He doesn't visit as much as he used to. If I don't figure out something, I may never see him again. Hey, you can't be, like, giving up everything. For a new man, alright? There's plenty of those to go around. You gotta think about your child, dude. If it's causing family issues, then that ain't the one. That ain't the one. <laughs> Why do these bags all keep moving? Makes sense, she didn't want to be a mother from the uh, abuse, but that's all she knows. Unfortunately, yes. You know what's weird? Are we the child in this situation? Because, like, look how, like, tall we are. Everything seems to be going well now that I've been uh, going out on dates. He was worried about my kids, so he bought them a bunch of books and toys. Uh, that should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it, but by the time I get back, I have no energy. I got contacted by the Child Welfare Center. I guess some noisy bitch or asshole in my building reported hearing a child crying at night in my place. The fuck do they know? He hasn't called me much lately. Am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is out enjoying life while I'm working my ass off raising kids. Why am I the fucking bad guy? If I hadn't had the children, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. Yeah, we're definitely shorter. That baby's not in the fridge, is it? Stop. That's a demon child. That that's a yeah, that's a demon child. Okay, I'm just gonna yeah, I'm just gonna move in here. You you can do your thing. Um that's all good. Miss Krista Planert, we have reached out to you repeatedly, but have yet to receive a response. We take this to mean you have no intention of rem blah, 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 remedy games that make pretty good games, you know, like Alan Wake and Control. Remedying this issue, you are in violation of German Civil Code Article 1631, Section 2. Accordingly, the federal court has instructed us to take your children. Should you have any objections to this, please contact us as soon as possible. So the child was, in fact, taken away. There is a big baby sitting in the trash. Okay. This is all storytelling, baby. <laughs> Boy found dead in... Oh my god, it actually fucking happened. A boy was found dead today in a refrigerator in the home of his 41-year-old mother. Person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body, Person A claims to have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him, and when she noticed he wasn't moving the next day, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to determine the cause of death. According to the investigation, person A's daughter ran to a neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrive, 
uh, arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested the mother after she confessed to her crime. It's the demon. Oh, so we, yeah, we are the child. So we're seeing it from the perspective of the child. You can't carry on that behavior! That's the endless cycle of abuse! That's not fair, man! Just got hearing I'm hungover, what the fuck going on? <laughs> An interesting thing to walk into when you're hungover, for sure. <laughs> so I wonder if her grandma was one of the uh, witches then, maybe? I I mean I feels bad um seeing this room here in the villa I tried so hard to forget this place damn okay she's had a rough upbringing uh feels majorly awful like yeah rough times dude now she became a mother yeah it's that cycle man it's that cycle. Oh, lovely! Give me a kiss. Actually, don't, don't. I'm. Oh. Fuck. Don't. I was kidding about the kiss. I don't want those lips. I'm good. I really like what you drew me way back. Oh my fucking god. Oh, go that way. Go that way. That is a way that you can go. Great. Uh, uh, yep. I don't know why we're picking up pictures. Oh fuck. Oh my god. No 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 no. Just keep running. Just keep running. Keep those legs moving. Just keep running and just keep running. We gotta keep those legs moving. Baba Ganoush. Baba Ganoush! It's a Swedish dip! I think. Made out of courgettes! Eggplant or something. I don't know. I think it's an eggplant based dip. Apparently it's pretty good. What am I doing? That's the wrong way. This way. This way. I think we're running in circles again. Okay, no. This is new. This is new. This is new. Yeah, this way. Then we go 209, right? 209's right. Then through, maybe not there. This is definitely new. We haven't seen this. Oh my fucking god. Okay, yeah, that's something. That's something. Okay, SB. SB on the phone screen? <laughs> She's kind of sexy, though. Jared, ignore the hell for- I'm trying to beneath me? Yeah, I, I'm trying to! <laughs> Just keep running. Brand new album. Fuck the scene. <laughs> My hit single. Alright, let's try that again. Oh. Oh. I'm hoping it saves the progress of the pictures and stuff I picked up. 
Although, to be honest, I don't know if the pictures actually matter. If those are just like a collectible or something. Ah, uh, shit. Because I think there are actual dead ends. This place is a goddamn labyrinth! They also use a lot of the same assets in the cages as well, so it's sort of like confusing to know exactly where you are and if you've been in this room. I haven't seen those shuttered doors, so that's a good sign, right? Oh, that's not a good sign. That uh, That is not a good sign. We're going to go back this way. Mm-hmm. Okay, it, do it, it doesn't save the pictures. All right. Okay, we're going back. Back the way we came. This is the next one. This way, I guess. Ah! Ah, ah, ah! This way! Ah, this way! Oh, no, 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 not that way, not that way, no. Okay, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. Oh, I don't know if that's a demon. Oh, that's a demon! Open the fucking door, main. Okay, we'll go through here. Okay, this is new, this is new, this is new. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You wanna give me like a map or something? No? Okay, that's fine. I'll, I'll just keep running. You know, this is great cardio. Absolutely fantastic cardio. Ooh, okay, there's another one. What's that? Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Boulder level. Okay, back this way. This way. This way. This way. This way. Open the door. Open the door. Twist the knob. Yeah, this must mean something, right? We're walking slower. Screen's going all staticky. My analog TV needs the bunny ears replaced or something. It's like low signal. I don't know. Aha. There's another one. I don't know if I'm at a dead end. Shit. 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 Okay, I think it's behind me. I think it's behind me. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We got this. Easy, man. Child's play. It's like strolling through the park. We are back at the beginning of this fucking maze. Nah, she's right behind me. She is right behind me. Ooh, okay, this is the room that we had to t turn around in. That's a big teddy bear. Yeah, it's kind of comforting. Oh my god. SB, this is it. No. 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 No! Nah, I won't look at you. Oh, dude, no way. What? Bro, it just gave me a dead end. It's like child's play ends up at the beginning of the maze. <laughs> Maybe this is part of it. I Surely, right? Okay, all right, let's try that again. The maze is constantly changing, though. That is one thing I'm noticing. I really like what you drew me way back. And then the phone is showing me that door that we found, so... 
Oh, the chains on the... F ah, okay, right. So we need... Got you. I need all of the photos. Okay. All right. All right. So we need all of the photos. Okay, hold on. So it's over there. This must be <laughs> what the guy who got the neuroplant chips keeps seeing. <laughs> yeah, sounds about right. What's that? Oh, you like what you see? And it's like right behind me. Um, I feel like the maze will just eventually lead you to where the photo is. Or, you know, straight into the demon itself. Yeah, it, it might also do that. Who knows? It's just kind of up, up to the maze as to what the maze wants to do. <laughs> Memory understood. There ain't no way I'm going to be able to remember, like, what way to go. <laughs> Everyone blames me. <laughs> All right. Anita, pull yourself together. we got to get through this demon infestation, all right? You can't be blabbering. I know it's scary. I would probably be, you know, weeping, crying, shitting as well. But right now? Right now we got to find photos. I really like what you drew me way back. Okay. All right. Problem is, too, we got, like, no phone torch. No phone torch. Okay, there's another one. You could audit an art class. So there must be like what three more? Oh my god, it's so dark. It's actually so dark. And okay, there's one at the end of this, I think. No, no, we're running past the suitcase again. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god! No, we've got that one. We're going backwards. We are going backwards. Which I think backwards means... The door with the chains, I believe. At least that's my theory! Okay, let's just go this way. Surely, right? Surely, surely. Something, 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 anything, something, anything. No, that's a dead end. Fuck, 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 fuck. There are like no visual indicators. Okay, blue, blue, blue. That must mean something, right? That must mean something. That's got to mean something. Blue paint? Okay, it's right there. Um, this way. Uh, no, through the door! Give the demon a big old kiss, they won't expect it. Yeah, I know, I wish I could. Catch it off guard? Okay, this is good, this is good. Haven't been through here yet. right there. I think that may have been one. This way? Maybe? Yeah. Yeah. What are you hiding inside? Two or three more. Okay, so two or three more. Two or three more. Okay, I don't think the maze actually randomly changes. 
It kind of seems like it was, but I don't think it does. So they are all in specific places. It's just a matter of finding them. What's that? One more, right? Oh. You like what you see? Where are you? Where are you? I'm sorry, Mom. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate this. I don't like this. I do not like you like. Oh god, I could be running around for like a million years trying to find this last one. Oh my god. Where are you? Ah, uh, I nah, man. Nah, man. Nah, man. Nah, man. Fuck, man. What the hell, man? No, already been here. We have already been here. I have... Oh my god, turn around! Turn around! We're going around town. I can't. I literally cannot tell, like, the, the corridors from one another. Like, I, I have no idea. I've got no idea where I'm going. What is what? Where is where? And if I end up running to the chain door, I am going to be trapped. Ah shit. Ah shit. Ah shit. Ah shit, I can't see. Ah shit. I feel like I'm going to end up at the chain door. I'm going that way. Shit. Shit. That's the chain door. That's the chain door. That's the chain door. Ah, Bubba Booey. Ah, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey, Bubba Booey. This way, this way, this way, this way. Let's go this way. Ah, Ganush, 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 Ganush. This one is dark as fuck, man. Ah! Onaiwa Shinchi no des. Ah! There it is. 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 Open that fucking door. Open that door. Go through here. I don't give a shit. That's locked. That's locked. Where are we going? Can't go through there. We can't go through here. Chain door. Chain door. Chain door. Chain door. Where are we going now? It sent me into like a completely different corridor. Chain door, right? That's locked? This way? Okay, chain door, chain door, chain door. The game just automatically puts you on a path to get to the chain door. Thank God. Holy shit. Thank God. <laughs> That's a different kind of stress, man. Like, honestly, that is a different kind of stress. Holy shite. Whew, we did it. Why is she moaning so loud? I mean, look. Hey, if I was in her situation, I don't know if it would be so much of a moan, but I'd definitely be like... <laughs> you know, like, I don't know, a cow being slaughtered type of sound, or maybe a meerkat being twisted, or, you know, I, I don't know, but it would be a sound of sorts. You know, in, in that sense, I honestly cannot blame her. I can't blame her for uh, making those sounds. I've been really absorbed in my work lately. I decided to paint the girls who jumped off the filler roof, okay? Uh, I'd like to think they left this place for something better. I think I might finally be free of my despair, anger, and hate. Despair, Xemnas shows up, favorite word. 
uh, because I've never felt this inspired. I'm going to put every last bit of myself into this piece. My roof piece is almost done. It might actually be my crowning achievement, but once this is done, then what? Do I have it in me to come up with something even better? How much longer can I enjoy the fame and praise I get now? Is there a despair and disappointment waiting for me right around the corner? Ah, yes. <laughs> the, uh... The creative process. <laughs> The sadness that gripped me before has clawed its way back into my mind. I guess it was always there. Who knows how often it'll show up. The thought makes my skin crawl. Maybe I should just end things while I'm still happy. Go out on a good note. I wish I could talk to someone about all of this. Hmm. Oh, okay. The painting is not all covered up now. So that's good. At approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th, popular graffiti artist C.B. Maya Aiko Hiddenberg uh, was found collapsed on the grounds of an apartment building in Kittenstead. Uh, she was pronounced dead at the hospital. The death of the 18-year-old girl comes as a shock to not only the local community members, but also to all those who were familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of death may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out foul play and are proceeding with a full-scale investigation. She killed herself half a year ago? And that means... Yeah, how long have you been tripping out for? <laughs> Damn! It'll take for you to forgive me. Please, end this. Just let me die. Um, is this game good? So it's very, uh, walking simulatory, which is kind of like what Silent Hill is sort of like. Uh, in parts, you know, generally the premise of the game is you running away from things chasing you. There is sometimes like a little bit of combat so far in this game, no combat. I don't think there is going to be any combat in this game. Um, so like if you like the whole walking simulator thing, you don't mind those, then you're going to be fine with that. As a horror fan, I think it's pretty cool. Um, and it gives me a bit of positivity for the future of Silent Hill going forward. I do enjoy these kinds of games, but that's just me. It's not obviously going to be for everyone. Um, and obviously this one's a little bit different in the sense that it's very meta in the way of its themes, social media, uh, the um, cons to that and how it affects mental health and all that sort of thing. Uh, so I guess in that sense, if you don't like really meta stuff, there's even like the mention of COVID in this, which is interesting and how that's had a toll on people's mental health. Uh, Shimmy, thank you so much for the 100 bits, man. I think we need a few laughs. Number one, so I ordered uh, a chicken and an egg online. I'll let you know which one comes first. And that will give us the definitive answer, right? Surely, surely. Uh, number two, they say time flies like an arrow. I say fruit flies like bananas. I see nothing but truth. Nothing but truth. Yeah, absolutely, fruit flies love bananas. They're basically like flying mini monkeys, right? That fucking fruit flies, man. Hate those fruit flies. Is she in a psych ward? Uh, quite possibly. I mean, quite possibly. She could be literally wandering around the ward and she's stuck in the Silent Hill phenomenon. Very psychological horror. Yeah, I mean, Silent Hill overall is incredibly psychological. Is this me? When did she draw this? I want to show the hidden side of girls. <clears throat> Impulses. Their urges. What are you hiding in? Find, find the other... Yeah, you were right, Trix. Find the other painting. Find it. Find it. Find it. She did notice me. That's it. You got your very own mural. You must be very happy, but a little bit regretful at this point. 
I've been really obs oh wait no I've, we've already read that my bad my bad my bad okay okay I'm assuming because this third life here is to do with her this is probably the final one this is a lot longer too than I was expecting like way longer I really thought it was gonna be like demo length but it really is just like a small mini experience <laughs> Just showing, yeah. I could have had a different life, too. I guess someone finally did love me. You actually noticed me. It's really wild for a free-to-play game. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of taken back that they've offered this for free. It's its own self-contained thing. What should I do? Um, it's not a demo. It's like its own experience. So, Pretty cool of Konami to do that, to give people, you know, who have been waiting for Silent Hill for such a long time, a little bit of a taste test as to what the future of this franchise is kind of looking like. I, for one, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. Yes. I should have figured that out sooner. Yes. Wait. Where are you right now? You're not doing it this time, right? Amelie. You were always there for me. Well, you're not doing it this time, right? I'm going to go. No. Apologize to Maya. Wait. No. No. No, that's not how it's supposed to end. She's supposed to form some clarity. People care about you, man. What do you... <laughs> Naya! Golden Goose friend. Golden Goose friend. Golden Goose friend. Golden Goose friend. Yes! We did it! We did it! I can see clearly now the fog has gone. Dun -dun -dun. I can see all the obstacles in my way. Well done. Well done. We have overcome the depression. Fucking awesome, dude. Very cool. Oh, it's sweet. That's wholesome. That's wholesome. I like that. I like that. Nice. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. Not true. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone. They need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. That's true. But That's true. I don't really mind. I 
just want someone to understand me. For those I love. Hey, I love you too, Colton. Thank you so much for, for the kind words, man. Me. I want Achievement unlocked. Defeat depression. Hey, we did it, baby. We did it, baby. <laughs> That was that was awesome. That was tight, man. I loved that, and I loved the uh, you know the message that it sends. Um, this is definitely the sort of game for people that have experienced, you know, like I personally myself, I've experienced depression, um, and maybe maybe like some kinds of abuse in a way. It's nothing as well, I don't know. I don't, I don't really want to compare it to like the stories that were on show here in this story. But I can relate to some of it. Um, and so... It certainly does send the message of, like, you know, it's important to just talk to people. I can't really recommend people that have gone through, like, crazy trauma to probably play this game. Um, because there's a lot of trigger points, I think, throughout it. But I think the message it sends is great. Um, it also teaches you that you're never alone in these kinds of circumstances either. So, hey man, I, I fucking... I, I loved that. I thought that was great. I thought that was great. Alright, I'm gonna skip that. Oh, very good. Look at that. Wait, are we in-game? No. One final mural. Very nice. You know, I, I thought that was great. And quite frankly speaking, I mean, this is coming from someone that hasn't had, like, a lot of experience with the Silent Hill franchise at all. Again, planning on doing that here on uh, the Twitch channel at some point. I'd love to start going through them. Heard a lot of good things about them over the course of time. Um, but that at least gives me hope that, like, this next sort of generation of Silent Hill games at least for me anyway, are going to be pretty enjoyable. Especially the Japanese-orientated uh, Silent Hill that they are making. It's a Silent Hill that takes place in Japan. That should be super interesting. 